Okay, guys, today I'm going to show you how to cut a perspex sheet using very simple tools. Um, I have to cut this to size from a baker sheet of perspex, acrylic sheet into a smaller one. So what I'm doing is going to be marking out the size and a very simple way to cut it. Sheet on top of say a cardboard piece so that when you cut the sheet it will not or the blade of your cutter will not cut into the concrete. So the tools you need will most likely be a heavy duty carpet cutter, a marker and a ruler. After marking out the correct length and you start with the longest length, first you use a marker and draw a line on top of the protective plastic sheet, plastic film over the perspex material as such. And lay a piece of cardboard or a piece of wood over the line to start etching out the line with the carpet cutter. And I was fortunate to have this piece of used tabletop from IKEA, which I find that it was extremely useful. All right, so add cut into the perspex using a piece of wood as a guide along the blind that you have etched out. Draw about maybe 10 to 20 strokes. When you're done, what you're going to do is to flip the perspex sheet over with the scrape line below and lay it flat on the floor or on some cardboard material and use the a piece of wood to line up with the line again. So now the scrap portion of the perspex is on the underside in such a layout with the piece of wood being on top of it, give about maybe a quarter inch or one eighth inch space be between the wood and the actual scrape line underneath the perspex sheet. And with your weight holding on to the wood on that line, you reach out to the perspex material and you pull towards you to break off right on the line. Now the film still attached the break off part and what you got to do is to cut away the plastic film and that's it. Two perfect separated perspex sheet of the correct size that you want.